Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's Wabi Snipe back with a video. In this video, I'm going to be bringing to you guys a gameplay with the brand new Pink Diamond Throwback Elite, Wilt Chamberlain. Before I hop into the video, guys, I do want to give a shout out to the homie B Street for letting me hop on and recording gameplay with his Pink Diamond World. A link to his Twitch will be in the description. Make sure you guys go show him some love. So today's Thursday, which means we got some throwback Thursday content. The teams were Chicago Bulls and the Philadelphia 76ers. So with that being said, we got five brand new cards today. We got a Pink Diamond Artist Gilmore, a Pink Diamond Chamberlain, a Diamond Bob Love, a Diamond Billy Cunningham, and an Amethyst Bobby Joe today. And as you guys see on the screen, we have a Pink Diamond Will in front of us today who we're going to be getting a gameplay with. And this card looks very, very solid, but he is one step lower than his Galaxy Opal. He's not as good. He's probably not going to be as good as, as his Galaxy Opal, but I'm pretty sure he's going to be almost as good. And we're going to begin the gameplay with the Pink Diamond Will today, as you guys see him in front of us on the screen. So without further ado, let's hop into it. 97 overall. He's a 7'1 big man. 275 pounds. He comes with four Hall of Fame badges, which are Pick and Roller, Put Back King, Lob City Finisher, and Tyler Score. The Opal one comes with like 17, I believe. He also has come with 12 goals, which are Brick Wall, Bruiser, Catch and Shoot, Chase on our Difficult Shots, Man Protector, Hustle Rebounder, Break Starter, Relentless Finisher, Post Pin Technician, Drop Stepper, Up and Under Specialist, and that rounds off the gold. Let's take a look at his stats right here. He does come with a 96 standing and a 95 driving layup. His post is really solid as well. 98 post fadeaway, 97 post hook, 75 open mid range, 50 open three. With the coach and shoe, you can get him up to a 60 open three. So yeah, 70, 70 free throw, 95 driving, 95 standing, and a 75 contact dunk. 44 ball control, his defense is really, really solid though. 96 block, 96 shot contest, 95 rebounding across the board for offensive and defense rebounds. 85 speed, 45 speed with ball, 95 strength, 95 stamina, 70 lateral quickness, 92 defensive consistency, 95 offensive consistency, and 97 reaction time. Honestly, guys, this card doesn't look as good as the Opal, but he looks really, really solid. I mean, the main difference is that the Opal can shoot threes and has way more Hall of Fame badges, which is why he's... A, he's Probably a lot better than this Pink Diamond one, but ultimately we're going to see how this Pink Diamond one performs in the game. So without further ado, let's hop into it. This is actually going to be a pretty interesting matchup because my opponent has a Diamond Will Chamberlain. We have a Pink Diamond one. And taking a look at both of them, 2K took off Wilt's Afro and Headband. That is really interesting. I don't know what 2K was doing, but hey, they wanted to switch up Wilt, how he looked in game. But we'll start off with the Pick and Roll and Slam. So yeah, guys, he doesn't have his Afro or Headband. I wonder if they change his attributes. Not attributes. I wonder if they. I wonder if they change the animations. I hope he didn't, but I don't know. So another pick and roll right here. He's overplaying it. So we're gonna hit him on the roll. He's going up and slamming that one home. So far, so good. He's playing just like the opal. So far, guys. Oh, nice. We're going to work right here with a nice double cross. Gonna hit Will on the lob. Going up top again and slamming that one home. This man right now is simply unstoppable in the paint. His paint is his, not only offensively but defensively as well. Let's run a big man to big man pick and roll right here between Will and AD. This isn't really going to be like the best play to do, but it should be pretty fun. He's committing to Will, I mean, excuse me, to AD. So we're going to dish it down to Will off the glass. And can I get that inbound steal? That should have been mine, 2K. Come on. He took like 10 seconds to inbound that ball. Okay, he's not back. Let's go. Push the ball up the court. Good pass for Magic. And come on. Thank you. <laughs> 2K was about to just do me dirty on that dunk. Thank you for letting me get that one to go. That was a little cheese, a little cheesy animation. But I'll take it because I deserve that bucket. With that mid-range though, he did activate his takeover, which we love. As he does have post scoring and I believe glass cleaning. Yeah, he's sending a double team. Roy's on the wing, wide open, green light. You can't double team in this man in the paint. You're going to kick it out and find the open man. All right, guys, real talk. My opponent is pretty good. He's pretty good. I do have to give it to him. So we're down by eight right here, but I am pretty confident I'm going to win this game. I'm very confident that I am. And so we're going to hit Will right here. Nice pass inside and two-handed jam. He wanted to off ball me right there. I know for a fact when you off ball, sometimes you fall asleep and we took advantage. I've been falling asleep. That's out of bounds. He's going way too fast. Our ball. Let's go to work right here, Roy. Oh, we're attacking the baseline. Gonna lob it up to Will. Let's go. That's a nice jam. I believe he has a pink. Is that pink diamond artist Gilmore? The new pink diamond artist Gilmore my opponent might have. I can't tell if that is. Kind of looks like it. Could be the diamond one, though. All right, guys, my, my uh, 2K just seems to let my opponent make literally everything he's taken this second quarter. I haven't got to stop to save my life at all. We're currently down by 11 points, but like I said earlier, I'm very confident that I'm going to come back. I'm not worried at all. Will now does have his post scoring takeover badge, so we're going to throw Artis Gilmore right off of me and go all the way to two-handed jam. That's exactly what I need. Some type of energy, some type of slam dunk is going to give me energy. 
and give me in a comeback mode. Let's go, Worthy. That's a great steal. Going to hit Will. He's running the floor. I don't know how he got that. He was closing out. We now have Amethyst Giannis on us in the paint. We got to take advantage of that. Three, two, going up for a reverse layer at the buzzer. Easy money. We're now down by seven heading into the second half. Like I said, guys, my opponent's good, but I know, I know I'm better than him. I know I'm going to come back and win the game, so let's lock in and do that. Let's start off this second half how we start off the game with a nice pick and roll and lob and easy slam dunk from Will Chamberlain. Magic Johnson has been throwing some excellent passes this game because he's one of the best, if not the best, point guard in the game. Good D. Let's go. We're getting that cheesy Turk Lou mess out of here. Can hit Kobe on the left wing. Easy money right here, right on the line. Let's go, Kobe. Down by four now. Start of fourth quarter right here. We have Roy with the slashing badge. Now we're going to lob it up to Will in the pain. Let's go. Down by one. Here we go. This is fourth quarter clutch time. We gotta clutch up and win this game. I'm like I said, I've been confident all game long, and that confidence is still very high that I am gonna win this game. Good D. What, what on earth? If this goes in, I would have lost it if that went in. Let's go. He's fouling me, and we are in clutch mode. Give it to Brandon Roy right here with his badge. We gotta let him go to work. Try to get a blow by on D'Angelo Russell. There we go. We got it. Now we're gonna allow it up to Will, and again. He has no choice but to commit to the slashing badge which, with Roy, which is leaving Will sitting in the paint open every time. We're now up by one, and he got a blow by right there. There's nothing we can do about that one. This game is really, really close. We're going back and forth all the way down to the wire. We're going to pick and pop Will for three. Bang! Will hit a three. I got super froggy. I feel like the momentum was on my side, which it was and which it still is right now. And we made a three with Wilt with only a 53. And I don't think that he has any of the shooting badges at all. Oh, you're bait. Oh, my gosh. It didn't give me that. Please don't give him that. Please. Oh, I baited him so bad. I don't know why it didn't give me that steal. But it's all good, though. Wilt now has his takeover badges, so we're going to go to work with the post-scoring one. Throw this artist Gilmore off of you. Throw this. Okay, Kobe's actually watching. What on earth is that? I wanted to go to Kobe. Not to the corner, but we'll take the slam anyway. Oh, let's go. Will's wide open. My opponent, I don't know what my opponent did right there. He left him wide open. Will to still the clutch two points. We're now by two with a minute 30 left to go, and we need a stop. A stop is a must right here. Good D. No, don't give him that. Don't give him that. I s mm, come on, 2K. What, what, Giannis, why are you not going to the corner? Oh, he missed. I can't believe he missed that. Let's go. Kick it to Brandon Roy on the right wing. Catching and shooting and making it. Let's go, Brandon Roy. What a clutch three-pointer. Five-point lead for us. A minute 12 to go. You know, what can I do about that, guys? You just simply can't guard Hidu. You need somebody 6'10 or high, 6'9 or taller to guard Hidu. It's as simple as that. It's crazy that how good Hidu is. Anyways, guys, that's a bad pass. Oh, my gosh. Attacking middle. Lob it up to Will. Let's go, Will. We need it. Let's go. Will Loki might have had the game winner, barring a stop right here. Assuming we get a stop right here, Will would have came down with the game winner for this game. Sag off, get to the paint, four, three. He's going for the win. Red contest, no way. That's game. Will clutch it out with a game winning dunk with nine seconds left to go. We got a stop, which means we got the game. Moving on to the box score, guys. Will to still finish with 44 points, 10 rebounds, one assist, three steals. Two turnovers, 21 of 27 from the field, one of one from three, and one of two from the free throw line. Now, but jumping into the card review, I'm going to give this Will Chamberlain a 9 out of 10. He's a step lower than the Galaxy Opal. He's, you know, I gave the Galaxy Opal a 10 out of 10, and he's not as good as the Galaxy Opal. But he's really, really good. So all in all, I'm going to give this card 9 out of 10. Now, on to the question that I'm sure a lot of you guys have came to the video for me to answer. And that is the question of... Did 2K change this man's animation because they changed his afro, they changed his headband? Did they change his animations? You guys know I'm always honest with you guys, and honestly, I did not feel like his animations were changed. They felt pretty much the same. Now, I only did play one game with him, guys, so, you know, I might need to play a couple more. But based on this game, he felt the exact same animations-wise as the Galaxy Opal did. But yeah, guys, I don't think that they changed anim animations that much if they did. Because I definitely didn't feel it, and Will Chamberlain definitely didn't feel it either because he shot like 75% from the floor. He went 21 of 27 field, which is like 78% actually from the floor. So with that being said, guys, it didn't really feel like his animations were changed. But I could be wrong. I really could be wrong. But based on this game, it just didn't feel like it. But yeah, guys, all in all, this guy is one step down from the Galaxy Oval. He's not as good as the Galaxy Oval, but he is a beast. Don't get me wrong. And he's a great alternative player for the Opal. If this man's going for like 120, 130,000 MT, you guys should definitely consider getting him. And also, I would recommend applying shooting badges to this card because if you give him corner specialist and catch and shoot at a three-point boost with the coach and shoot, 
If you have a 59, so you're gonna have like a 60 open three with the shooting badges. You might be able to hit some, but you know, you probably won't be able to be hitting a lot. We hit one, which is kind of lucky, you know, but all in all, you won't be shooting any threes with him. That's the main difference between the Opal and this card. The Opal can shoot threes and has way more Hall of Fame badges, and the Pink Diamond can't shoot threes and only has like three or four Hall of Fame badges. So all in all, guys, this card is still a good card regardless. All right, guys, that pretty much sums it up. Shout out again to homie Beastry for letting me hop on recording Pink Diamond World Gameplay. Link to his Twitch will be in the description. Make sure you guys go show him some love and drop him a follow. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, and this is YBC. I'm out. Peace.